How do you do the lifecycle management of MCP servers? Because th that's not the sexy bit. It's if I put something in production, I want to make sure this doesn't change overnight because someone made a change. And this is the real conversation that's going on behind the scenes. You see Atlassian said, we're, we're hosting our own official server, but people are still worried about when they change a tool, it's it, their production agents are now going to suddenly have different capabilities. Uh, so GitHub is taking a different approach. GitHub is saying, our, we'll have an official hosted MCP server and a official MCP server you can run locally, which makes enterprises feel a lot better because I can have a version of that server running locally. I can run all my tests and scans. And then when I'm ready for the next version, I can upgrade. So I think over time, everything switches from community-built MCP servers to ve official vendor-provided MCP servers. And in the meantime, you need tools that are giving you the ability to do that sort of life cycle that we allow 